from flooding to fires. The savage nature of Australia's extremes has been felt by all across the region, but its farmers fearful life could get even tougher with another dusty decade possibly in the pipeline. Heading towards a drought again, let's hope it's not a long-lived drought. Certainly hope that's not the case, but I, I do think we do need to take steps now to drought-proof the basin. New statistics released by the Department of Primary Industries shows New South Wales is slipping closer to drought. 73% of the state is now marginal, a 26% jump in the last month alone. The last drought was devastating. You know, um, no one could grow anything. There was only enough water to keep permanent plantings alive. Producers believe it won't be long until storage supplies run dry and are once again calling for more dams to be built. The only way to uh, make sure that we have a viable irrigation industry Australia-wide is to catch, to catch more water. The state has launched an inquiry into the adequacy of water storages in May last year and is still in progress. It took around 25 years to complete construction on the Snowy Mountain Scheme and those dependent on irrigation are begging the government to start work before it's too late. If we don't start now, you know, we're never going to get anywhere. Dean Foscarini, Win News.